Hello, everybody. This is uh, Art Walk Carnival of Light. I am Amy Zanders. Welcome. I hope you'll enjoy what we have in store for you today. Um, this is the fifth one that we have done. And as you can see, the clouds, they're still up there, but uh, no rain. So we're lucky, fingers crossed, that it will remain like this for the rest of the day. We have Taylor Rankin performing later on, Dan Bice, Quinn. Um, the Highland dancers will be performing soon. It's going to be an amazing night. All right, I'm here with Miss Melina. Look at her. She's doing her doodles and everything, and she's amazing. I love her. I'm so happy that you're here. Thank you. Amy, I really appreciate the opportunity to showcase some of my work. Why is art important to you? How has it influenced your life? Um, I think art's important, just cultural awareness, just the passion. Um, I was in the corporate world for over 10 years and now I'm doing this full time and I cannot tell you what it's done for my soul. Like stress free, it's amazing. I actually have a doodle art club, I teach the kids as well and it's, it's working out really well, it's awesome. That makes me so excited! excited. So how are you liking this event and what do you feel um, about having events like this? I think it's just crucial for this community, especially bringing everybody to St. George's because I must admit it's hard for me to get to the East, but I made the commitment and I'm here, so I hope everybody comes out. Yay! I'm so proud of you. I'm so happy for you. You're going to go a long way. Thank you, Amy. Hi, I'm Sheena Nutter and I'm representing Young Living Therapeutic Essential Oils. If you're, if you're a herbalist or you're a practicing herbalist and you dry things like peppermint and lemongrass, they, you dry them out and you get that essence for a bit. But the essential oil is an incredibly uh, complex process and it gets the essence of the oil so you use just a tiny bit. I can be reached at uh, youngliving.org, that's Sheena Nader at youngliving.org and my telephone number is 332-2847. Good evening and welcome to Saltwater Boutique. Um, we have specialty designs of Bermuda Sea glass, uh, Venetian glass, imported from Italy, semi-precious stones, uh, Bermuda pink sand, freshwater pearls. All the items in here are handcrafted by myself, my mom, my young daughter, three generations of crafters. We've been creating for like 17 years, so mostly our, our inspiration is based on what we see, the beauty of our island. Um, the, the natural beauty of the water, the landscape. Um, could even be people's personalities sometimes. You see the beauty come from within. It could be, you know, that's our inspiration. Oh, and don't let me forget my son, Dre. He's a graphic artist. He actually does our logos and all our print design. Um, art is his life. He lives and breathes art. Hi, my name is Colleen English Tagrilla. I'm a co-captain for Relay for Life Team Super Swizzlers. Woo! So we've decided to set up a booth here at the Art Walk tonight in order to raise funds for our team. And um, we're having a bake sale, we're selling plants, and we're selling luminaries. Please come on down. <laughs> Everyone, we're here with the Art Advocates, 
and their spokesperson, Danny Penn. Danny, could you explain what's going on? We're advocating for arts education, and as you can see, we're all here as a group, as a community, working together in the spirit of art and creativity, and really advocating for arts education all across the island. I love this quote by Einstein. It's like, if we just keep teaching our kids, oh, you have to learn this, and learn this test, and pass this test, and pass this test, we never give them time to think about anything, and then we don't give them time to create the new ideas. Take that out of our curriculum by saying you have to learn this and learn this and learn this and well, what about their ideas? Kids have more ideas than we do and, and we have to give them that opportunity. So That's right, left brain's just as important as right brainers. My name's Kristen, this is my shop, the bookseller. Come on in and see what we have. We are mostly a secondhand bookstore, but we also have some new books too. So in the bookseller, we share the space with Donna Smith of Peaceworks, um, and she's a mosaic artist. So in her in her shop, she's got lots of mosaic work, candle holders, frames, um, wall art, and then she also sells bags and scarves and jewelry and cards. And so between the two of us, we're a great you know business for gifts, for special events, for picking up quick books to read on holiday, for souvenirs, so bookseller and Peaceworks. Books are art to me um, and so I think it is. I know that like you said it is people that are reading Kindles and you know it's becoming more electronic but I think that people who love the feel of a book and that, the experience of reading a book, um, I don't think that that's going to go away. So I think there are, you know, we're, we're definitely fighting, um, but I think it's, there's always going to be people that love books. So hopefully when you're in St. George's, you'll stop in to see us at the bookseller. Bye. I'm Taylor Rankin, this is my violin Leroy, and you're watching Channel 82.